Hello, whippersnappers. Welcome back to another YouTube video. And in today's video, sorry if that was ear rape, we are looking at Windows XP. Oh no. What a great way to start off the video. <laughs> oh god, is it gonna stop? Christ. Anyway, guys, I don't know why it's doing that. I mean, I'm in a virtual machine. All right. So I actually do use this virtual machine quite a bit. I actually like to test old versions of code, like my PC cleaner. Never mind. I'm going, why is it so slow? Did I change something? Oh. System. Yeah. Two gigs of RAM. Maybe I should put four. Oh, I, oh man. Hold on. Look at all these skins I have, guys. Actually, one of my favorites. There it is. This one's one of my favorites. I'll leave that over to the side. Um, anyway. Uh... Can you still use it? Yes, but if you want to, I recommend getting a VPN, um, which a good alternative. Oh, hey there, Mudhar. A good one is to do Winscribe. Winscribe Windows XP Edition, which exists. Like, they actually have one specifically made for older computers so that you can still use them. So. Um, what you need to do is go to a friend's house or somebody else's computer and download Windows XP compatible apps. Mozilla Firefox, um, crap, what version is this? If you look up on the Google, what version of Firefox will work on Windows XP, you should just be able to look at that to download an older version. I'm just going to try to update. I, uh, can't. And it does not seem to be like, I, I looked up, there's a website called Browsers for XP, but a lot of them I've never heard of before, and like, it's, you can't even install them. I tried installing half of them, and they just wouldn't work, so. And this is the latest version of Windows XP, like, last update was installed. Like, I have, if you don't, if you can't, can, you know, because you can't download the updates anymore, so you can actually still go to the catalog and, up and download it yourself. Put it on a flash drive and then put it on Windows and then run it because it's an EXE file. So, but this still works. Like I can go to YouTube, except it is slow. Now, I don't know if there's a way to make it, like, skinnier, or, like, make it not as heavy. I don't think there's, like, a, a version, or, there might be an extension you can download or something, to where it'd be easier on it. Uh, look at all this. Performance. But this is a website I really recommend if you're using an old computer. Watch this. I really wish websites um, like YouTube kept uh, would keep older like HTTP for older computers. I wonder if someone made like a version of YouTube like a website that you can use YouTube. Do I have Google Chrome? I think I do actually have it on here. Uh, I am so used to having that search feature. Just being able to type, I'll do that on here. I thought I downloaded Google Chrome on here. No? I 
Uh, I'll try this. Hold on. Download Google Chrome. I think it was E O L. But I think this will still realize I'm on a little version and let me download it anyway. Connecting to the interwebs. Oh wow, look at this guys, it worked. And look how broken it looks. That's not right. Um sure refreshing. You can actually use the old net on old browsers too. Like the original Windows uh IE, which its birthday is coming up soon. Oh wait, no, never mind, that's the wrong thing. Start 2010. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. It takes forever to load. Um, and I don't know why it looks like this. Yeah, the old net isn't that great. <laughs> it's, it could be very buggy. The connection is not private. I don't care. Wow, even Google.com is unsafe. Oh yeah, this is like a 2015 version of Chrome. Oh yeah, there's not even a thing called safe. Jesus, in the last five years, browsers really came that mo that far. Oh my god, there's not even a thing called safe browsing. I wonder if there is. Man. Apps. Hold on, how do I get this to stop coming up then? Cause like, that's gonna be annoying. Honestly, I might have to go to AOL. Hold on, is that, is that a thing still? <sighs> Third. Manage certificate. Uh. What can I just do security? I think it's like internet settings, which... Uh, crap. Interesting. Oh no, here it is, internet options. Security, custom level. Let's just disable everything. Reset to low. Low security. Ooh, blue no. We have to have it accept all cookies. Cause I I don't know how to manage certificates on here. I I know how to you know. Can I export certificates on my browser? Hold on. How to export certificate from Chrome. <clears throat> well, how do I get to it? What? Oh, we're right here. Oh. Oh, there's, there's, there's nothing here. Wow. So I can't export it. Okay. Oh, I don't think that's what I meant. I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm doing. Anyway, guys, watch this. Google.com. Okay, hold on, guys. What is this thing wanting from me?
Uh, dude. I just think Joe can right now. Oh my god, is this thing serious? Guys, how do I do this? That's something else. So install. I mean, yes, this can be trusted. Don't know why it wouldn't. System unsupported. Huh, interesting. Light setting. Uh, God, there's like nothing on here. God, Jesus, Chrome is very empty in 2015. Well, I don't know. It feels like 2016 Chrome and 2015 is like so different. Like, I think that's when it all changed, like in one year. This is crazy. I feel like the 2015-2016 difference in those two, in, the, in just those two, is just a thing. Sure, I mean, I don't know why it's gonna, uh, yeah, sure, they're not gonna do anything for it. Um, old YouTube. Go old YouTube, see, can I even add it? Uh, come on. Add a crumb. God dang it, well. Alright, uh, what about YouTube? Will it let me go on this? And I wonder if it'd work better if I, uh... It really does seem like Firefox is working better. Let's see if Windscribe will help. If I, uh, use my VPN. Which, guys, it's $2. It's technically 5 bucks a month, but you can do a build-your-own-plan, which just the United States and Canada servers and unlimited, uh, data is 2 bucks a month, so... For a VPN, that's pretty great, and it, like... You have preferences, not on this one, but on like my computer. Here, I'll show you. Never mind. It actually um has. Put that wrong. I want to see. Does AOL work? This is getting on how to do that every time. Oh my god, it works. Except it's very broken because it's. Probably running on a potato. Uh, nah, this is taking a long time, but I'm going to show you what's on mine. Unscribe real quick. The server speeds aren't the greatest. I can say that much, but whatever. I can pirate with it. I'm joking. Firewall, I always leave my manual. DNS while connected, you really should put it to Cloudflare. It's better than Google. Um, if you want this on, it's not a really good idea. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then you got. Prefer oh wait, not the oh yeah, not this one. You have to go on my account and pretty much what it will do is you can have it set to where if you want it to block ads on websites and stuff, it's pretty cool. This is taking a long time. Well can this still work? Let's see. Don't miss music premium. Student plan. Oh, it does not work. Oh, look at that. Look how broken it is. Oh, left by hip hop. Will it play? Or will it give me that generic HTML5 or? Or it'll just work. Oh, I mean, oh. Okay. Okay, okay. God, it's already on one. Oh, God, okay. <laughs> hey, look, at least the chat still works. Oh, my God, and there's an ad. This is. This, is, this just isn't working. Now let's compare that to Firefox real quick. Because I know Firefox videos works on here. 
I think Firefox made it to where we could use this browser as long as possible on XP without actually having to switch. Yep. But I do know some videos will play on this still. Okay, kind of actually want to see that. Are you coming or not? We'll see that I'm on a wizard. Kind of funny. Now that we've helped people customize ads. and save with Liberty Mutual, we can finally oh. do some beach reading. <laughs> La tortilla está muy seca y no tiene sabor. I don't understand the craziness of Takis. My name is Xochitl. My you name is Lucy. You, you and today I'm talk. ranking in Mexican snacks. Boo boo loo boo. Ooh. Even though it has chocolate, but you put this in the freezer. Get out here. God, why is this stupid virtual machine? You know what? Screw it. Ugh, very tempted to. Anyway, guys, can you use Windows XP in 2021? Yes. But why would you? Did Well, the only reason I did it is because I felt nostalgic. But wait a minute. Is that Tor of Windows XP? All right, hold on. I'll play that in a second. But, um, yes, it's still usable. I mean, if you really wanted to use it, Go off the grid. For one, what did you do? I mean, you know what? I, I don't want to know. But good luck. Don't get caught by the FBI. And I am.